foundation? What foundation? Stay tuned on this channel if you want to learn more. <laughs> My name is Zeke Matthew, and welcome to Animated Christians. And if you want to learn more about what we do on this channel, stick to the end of this video. We are in the middle of a series called What's the Church? And this episode is dedicated to the foundation of the church. I'm not saying all churches or all pastors are like this. I'm just trying to get rid of the mindset that we created the church to be. Let's talk about the foundation of the church and where it comes from. It seems to stem from Matthew chapter 16 verse 18, which says, This is why I have called you Peter Rock, for on this rock I will build my church. The church will reign triumph even at the gates of hell. This scripture is often the most quoted scripture in church, and it's the basis of what each church is based on. So, it basically means every church is built on this rock, and this has been taken to the most literal sense and spiritual sense, and all churches believe they are built upon this rock of scripture. You may be asking, how is this a bad thing? Well, let's keep reading. In Matthew chapter 7 verse 24 through 27 says, Those people who are listening to me, those people who hear what I say and live according to my teachings, you are like a wise man who built his house on a rock on a firm foundation. When storms hit, rain poured down, and waters rose, broke, and winds beat all the walls of that house. But the house did not fall because it was built upon rock. Those of you who are listening and do not hear, you are like a fool who builds a house on sand. When a storm comes to his house, what will happen? The rain will fall, the waters will rise, the wind will blow, and his house will collapse with a great crash. Let's look at a definition of a rock. A definition of rock is used to refer to someone or something that is extremely strong, reliable, or hard. Churches believe that their building is built on the rock of this scripture, but a lot of times they are more built on the sand when things come along rather than the rock. Let me take you to another scripture that might clear some air here. In Matthew 13 verse 1 through 2 says, As Jesus left the temple later that day, one of the disciples noticed the grandeur of Herod's temple. Teacher, I can't believe the size of these stones. Look at these magnificent buildings. Look closely at these magnificent buildings. Someday, there won't be one of these great stones left on another. Everything will be thrown down. Notice how he said magnificent buildings in the scripture. A definition of magnificent is making a splendid appearance or show of exceptional beauty, size, etc. And what do we have as a foundation of the church? Magnificent buildings. So, what is the foundation that Jesus is talking about then? Well, simply, he is passing his ministry on to Peter to continue his work. The word church is very confusing in the Bible, and I always wonder why that was. Well, that's because what Jesus is saying is not the word church, but he means family, like the passing down of a generation. So, Jesus is speaking on a family, and have you ever noticed in this one little scripture that there were no churches, synagogues, they were all together like a community family, and now you are a part of this family too. This is exactly what Jesus is talking about. He is building a family up. Why do you think he said, go make disciples? It's to bring people back to his family. 
So I hope this cleared something on the foundation of the church and if you agree or disagree with this then leave a comment below and join me next time where we will be discussing the perfection of the church and never forget animated Christians is just for you. Don't leave just yet. For those who got to the end of this video, I want to congratulate you. And I do want to make a shout out real quick to Autism Week for people with autism. Now, what is Animated Christians all about? It is about original movies and series as well as clean anime and manga reviews. And the original series is what you just watched. So if you want to learn more and see more original movies and series like this, consider subscribing and clicking the bell icon for future videos.